Ray Trujillo takes on Cosmo Alexander. Ladies and gentlemen, our fourth fight of the night is being brought to us by Ready Every Second and is scheduled for three rounds of five minutes each in a legacy lightweight division. Introducing first on my right, fighting out of the Star Motorcycles Blue Corner. He stands five feet, nine inches tall, his official weight, 155 and three quarter pounds. This headhunter enters tonight's contest with 15 wins and 10 defeats, 11 wins coming by way of knockout. Fighting out of Houston, Texas, Ray. The Warrior True Hilo. And across the cage on my left, fighting out of the MO2Go.com red corner. He stands six feet, two inches tall, his official weight 155 and one quarter pounds. This world champion kickboxer holds a record of five victories and a lone defeat. Fighting out of Boca Raton, Florida, by way of Santos, Brazil, Cosmo. Good boy, Alexandre! You talk about the Muay Thai career of Cosmo Alexander. 2009, he won the King's Cup in Thailand. The King's Cup is the biggest event over there. Protect yourself at all times, obey my commands at all times. Watch it live in honor of the King of Thailand. To win that is legendary, and Cosmo did it in 2009. He comes in the favorite here tonight, Cosmo, minus 305. The comeback on Trujillo at plus 225. Look for Trujillo to come out of the gate blazing here and test the jaw of Cosmo. Jumping sidekick early on from Trujillo. Cosmo, a very patient fighter in mixed martial arts as he was in Muay Thai. Often criticized as a slow starter. Very much a feeling out fighter. And he throws their front kicks early. Look at him stalking Trujillo, man. Huge reach advantage here for Cosmo. 74 inches in the arms versus 66 and a half of Trujillo. Cosmo wow. stepped through knee. He had sick intentions with that knee. Barely missed with it. Beautiful thing that great tie fighters do that he did there. He trapped that foot, pinching it between his arms, between his wrists, clamped down on it, and then pulling him, trying to pull him back into a punch. Definitely do not want to be there with a guy like Cosmo Alexander. Last time we saw Cosmo on Access TV was in Lion Fight in Las Vegas at Fremont Street, September 20, when he fought Nampon, defeated Nampon by decision. Former WMC Intercontinental, WPMF World Champion, Cosmo Alexander. And a groin shot here for Trujillo. Kind of self-inflicted to a certain extent. He was throwing a knee up over the top at the same time. Bit of a patella to the old fella from Cosmo Alexander. Trujillo, a blue belt in Bushy Ban MMA Systems. As often said in interviews, he only wants to fight another five or six years and then pursue a Hollywood career. That's under the high left roundhouse. You've got to commit more on those takedowns. This, when you're fighting a guy like Cosmo Alexander, that's when you hope you're a D1 All-American wrestler, to be honest with you. Look at the tie clinch here. Even off the single hand from Cosmo, who just wrenches the neck of Trujillo, lands the knee to the right rib cage and liver section. Good control, be impatient. Beautiful knee again off the right leg there from Cosmo Alexander on legacy debut here tonight. This is Cosmo's world. Pulling the head down, the body in. His knees scoring for Cosmo. Backs it into the right side of the body. I feel like we're uh, commentating the line fight. Huh? We will be again March 28 in Las Vegas at the Hard Rock. Tried to trap the arm. He tried to trap the arm there and hit him with a throw. He's going to have to do more than that to get this guy up his feet because in that clinch work, tie fighters are always trying to toss each other. Tight double forearms guard, downward elbow. Trujillo, south horse turn, sticks the jab. Osmo, like a big lynx, just stalking his prey here. Tall, reachy, powerful fighter. Trujillo needs to do that. Throw three or four punches and hit a deep double leg and put him on his back. Gotta follow up. 
outside crescent kick from Trujillo. Cosmo oh, wins in again with that knee. You know, you know he's practiced that a lot. We've seen him do that in Muay Thai. He throws that left hook to the head, and then that opens up the liver, and he sneaks that left knee into the liver. Did it there. Cosmo Alexander, who finished high school, never went to college, and so he opted to live in Thailand and dedicate himself to Muay Thai. Became a household name in the sport as a result of that. Cosmo shook his head at Trujillo saying, yeah, let's trade, bud. Let's do it. Solid right hand down the center corridor from Cosmo Alexander. Oh, I tried to catch him coming in with the elbow. Nasty. Oh, it's full oh. tight, clean elbow drops in. This one's over. Good night, Irene. Welcome to Legacy Cosmo Alexander. Scary striking, man. Muay Thai 101. We've got to see that again. Locked on the tie clean through the elbow. Bye bye, Rangeri here. Brutal. My word. This would be called precision striking in MMA. Tried to catch that elbow coming in, but here's the quick little elbow to the temple and then the knee to the jaw dropping right on his face. Pat, the beauty of that was that Trujillo was expecting the knee off the full tie clinch. He went with the elbow instead. Yes, yes. The, the ability to change up, look at that. And then through the knee. Beautiful change up, caught him off guard. Cannot get wild with a guy like this. And like I said, that's when you hope you're a D1 All-American wrestler because you do not want to stand up with this guy. He's patient, he waits for it. His precision striking will get you eventually. Ladies and gentlemen, three minutes, 38 seconds of round number one. Your winner by TKO Cosmo. Good boy, Alexandre.